All right, this is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize the number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the U.S. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-reigning champion. If he's going to get this done, it's going to take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night ten. Undisputed baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion. And man, does he have all the confidence and the self-belief that comes with that distinction. Yeah, when you're the baddest man on the planet, you are confident. You have to be a bit arrogant, a bit cocky. And that's what this guy has. He has been here on so many different occasions. This is like another night in the office, but you could never tell by the way that he prepares. When you watch him prepare, he treats every one of these defenses as, as if it's the first time he's fighting for a UFC championship. No, you put that well. He has had that patented intensity about him this week, trying to occupy some headspace in the challenger. Huge heavyweight title fight is upon us. Won't be long now, coach. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Dynamite. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Mystery. All right, Herb Dean, our referee for this one, just about to get underway. Well, great to have you with us tonight from Bell Center here in Montreal, Quebec, Canada, and per capita, these people make as much noise for mixed martial arts as any fan base in the world, and obviously a very exciting atmosphere for the fighters. In this it's a great environment for the fighters. It's a great experience for the fans. There aren't many places in the world that fighters love to compete in more than the Bell Center in Montreal. Lands the left punch, now followed by a right. Man, this is crazy, DC. These fighters are not trying to just touch each other. They're trying to put each other out with every shot. John, with every shot, these guys are trying to end the fight. What a start. Oh. Now we're going. Trying to do damage now with the kick, that's a miss. Left hook to the head. Oh, he lands another shot to the head. Double jab is there. He gets to the single collar side. Look for him to drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. All right, champ, starting to see some swelling upstairs now. Well, he's taking way too many shots to the head. 
You got to move your head. You cannot be on a straight line. Otherwise, you will take shots, and that shot, and those shots leads to your face starting to swell. Nice defense. He got his hands up and blocked it. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, he's hurt him again. Well, I'm not sure if I should knock his fight IQ, but it seems like he's sort of playing around here. Feels like the finish is there for the taking. Yeah, the finish is there. And he needs to take his time to try and find it. Don't rush. Be patient. And in that patience, you'll find a punch or kick that will put your opponent out. Bleeding from his cheek now. Damage done. Landed a good uppercut there. Oh! Oh, big left. Two minutes now to go in the opening round. Lands a nice jab there. He engages in a single power tie. Oh, my goodness! Oh, no, a big left hand! Oh, 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 oh. Able to get back to his feet yet again. Oh, but not a good look for the judges here. Look how wobbly he is. Oh, that one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> So perhaps he's going to have to address something defensively. There is a legitimate cut around his eye. Yeah, he got cut on the eye from that last strike. He's got to pay attention now before it gets worse. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice good series of kicks by him there. Oh! And that will do it! Holy smokes! Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, the official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 25 seconds of the very first round. To playing the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Dynamite! So how about this? We have a new UFC heavyweight champion of the world. I think that guy beats Daniel Cormier. I, think I mean, he does. this guy beats anybody. I'm telling you right now, he is the king of the world for a reason. The number one heavyweight in the world. A guy that possesses knockout power, confidence, and heart. It's going to be very difficult to take this belt away from this champ.